Hello, everybody. So um, it's been about a week since uh, our last video. And, um, you know, I thought things would slow down, but <laughs> they haven't. Um, and uh, it's been a pretty eventful week. Um, so I'll just get right to it. Um, it's been great to have the uh, the visa. Well, I don't have the physical visa. I have just the letter. And I, I didn't know this, but I learned that um, I had hoped to be able to uh, finally get out of the country for a little trip. Uh, I have a friend in Lisbon, Portugal, and I was ne I had never been. I've never been to Portugal. So I thought I can, right now, while I don't have work yet, um, I will. I could take a trip, but I found out that uh, you, the letter will not get you back into the country. So um, I'm going to wait until I have the real, the real visa, the physical visa, and um, and decided instead to go to Bamberg, uh, down in northern Bavaria. I was trying to find some a, a small, beautiful town that. Uh, I could spend just a couple days in just just to get out of the city and be somewhere uh you know a little more uh um relaxing and whatever. I mean it's not that you know it's not New York. It's not like having to get out of New York. Uh I'm fine, but um you know, I want to I want to see more of the country and um and uh, so that's where I'm going to go next week. Uh, Thursday through Sunday, I believe. Um, and then Lisbon, hopefully, I will be able to get to soon. Um, so this week, uh, the la or since the day of the visa, um, <clears throat> that's what it'll be officially known as from now on, the day of the visa. Um, on the 14th, my uh, class in... <clears throat> excuse me, in New York had uh, its show and the kids did really great. I was very proud of them. It was really fun. Um, and that'll be starting up again with a new group of kids in a couple of weeks. So uh, I'll still have that job, which is great. Um, still teaching my private lessons as I have been. On the 15th, um, this new uh, these new friends of mine who are uh, both a couple who are both musical theater performers that uh, are pretty pretty busy working around the country. Um, we got together. We've been talking about getting together for a long time. These are the ones I met when I got lost going to Mayan Meldung. Um, and uh, they he wanted to take me for some real tacos. He's Mexican, so but he lives here. So he uh, took me to Taqueria del Osa, and uh, they're good. They're like, they're the closest I've had to, you know, real tacos since I've been here for sure. Um, and uh, I wish they had chicken and fish tacos there. I'll just be honest. But it still, can't complain. It was, it was good. And we stayed for, I think we were there six hours and they don't throw us out. So it was really nice. Um, and we had a lovely time. Um, this is up on, uh, it's near, um, well, I got off at the Rosa Luxemburg Platz stop on the U-Bahn, but it's actually one stop further. I, it was closer to an, the next stop. But anyway, um, uh, what was I going to say? Oh, there's a store there. It's, a, it's in a complex that has some really cool little restaurants and stores and they have a Mexican food shop, a store with some great stuff. So I'm, I want to make tamales one of these days soon. And so I'm going to go back there and get some stuff. Um, so that was, that was fun. I had a really nice time with them. Um, so starting kind of on the next day, I, I um, was reminded or yeah, reminded and told more by, um, a friend who's been helping with the visa and all of that, giving me information um, that now, now that I have the visa and I also got my Steuernummer, 
um, in the mail finally. Um, so now that I have those, I need to apply for KSK, which is short for Künstler Sozialkasse, um, and which is a sort of, uh, it's not an agency, but it's like a, um, an organization that helps uh, artists, uh, performing artists and other kinds of artists, um, making sure they have uh, their insurance correct. And um, there's a lot of benefits to them. I'm not uh, exactly sure <laughs> what they do. I'll find out. But I was told I should uh, get them, uh, uh, get uh, connected to them. So uh, I'm waiting for the application in the mail for that. And then I'm almost done filling out the GVL application, which, oh my God, help me. Gesellschaft zur Verfertung von Leistungsschutzrechten. Gesellschaft zur Gesellschaft zur Verfertung. How do you do this? Anyway, um, yeah, GVL. It's much easier. Um, I can say it slowly, but I can't say it fast. So um, uh, that is like an agency that helps. Um, it's like BMI and ASCAP in the U.S., which pays performers for radio and TV broadcasts of stuff. I don't have very much of that, if any. I was on the. I was on TV once. I was on the radio once. Anyway. But it's good to be involved and connected to these organizations as I'm here and, you know, uh, for when I renew the visa and all of that. So um, getting uh, is, uh, I'm almost done getting into that. And then GEMA is another one. G-E-M-A is for composers, which probably I'll, I'll, I'll need more because uh, my stuff does get performed here and there. Um, so I need to apply for that one, too. So... KSK, G GVL, and GEMA. Um, I'm spending a lot of time learning about those and uh, figuring out, you know, or filling out all the things I have to fill out. Uh, yesterday, the American couple, the female half of the couple, had uh, her birthday. And so a little group of us went to Brew Dog, um, a little pub, and had uh, pizza. It was good pizza. And, uh, and beer last night and had a really nice time. Um, that was fun. And uh, for lunch, I had made, I bought, actually, I didn't make it from scratch, but Maltaschen, Maltaschen. Um, and uh, they're good. They're good. I had some in soup, and then today I did some in with onions, kind of sautéed with onions and browned with butter. They're yummy. They're really yummy. And then today I had a job interview um, and it looks like I got it. Uh, I believe the, they said they're sending me all the stuff tomorrow. So yeah, I haven't signed anything yet, but you know, and I know that the other ones were going to happen and then didn't happen. <laughs> so I probably shouldn't say anything, but I'm excited. So I'll, you know, if it doesn't happen, I'll let you know. Um, but, uh, it looks like I got it and I'll tell you more about it when it's definite. Um, which should hopefully be in the next few days. So, um, and it's a good situation. It pays well and it's, I can make my own hours somewhat um, doing these sort of week long theater uh, programs um, all over Germany, actually. So I'll get to travel, which will be nice and see more of the country. Um, so I'm, that, uh, I'm pretty happy. I mean, in four months, it looks like, you know, I've gotten most things together. So um, I'll let you know if that's a definite yes, but I believe it looks pretty good. Um, and uh, my roommate wanted um, some white trash American food. So I made tuna noodle casserole tonight, not with the Campbell's cream and mushroom soup. I don't do that. Um, I made a bechamel and sautéed mushrooms instead of that. But everything else is pretty much what goes into a tuna noodle casserole. And if you don't know what that is, I can you can make a comment and I'll write a comment and I'll let you know. <laughs> it's it's a quintessential American trashy meal. 
Um, it was good. I missed it. I haven't had it in a long time. Um, other than that, I have, you know, been working on, on composing on my opera and as, uh, uh, my show Gilgamesh, um, writing a new song for that. That's coming along actually nicely. And, um, and now I need to figure out my phone situation. That's the next thing to figure out too. I posted online to Americans in Berlin. Uh, 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 it's a Facebook group, Americans in Berlin, and just asking what people do. And uh, I have a lot of suggestions and I just have to look through and really see what's the best situation for me. Um, so, uh, I got to figure that out too. So there's, there's still a lot to do. Um, and, uh, I have two possible apartment situations starting in March also. So, um, um, one would be, well, both of them would be living alone. One would be more of a long term sublet. The other one would be my very own place, but we'll see how, we'll see what happens. So, um, that's the latest. It's still happening. I'm still learning a lot and, and, uh, I'm amazed how nicely things have been falling into place and just cross my fingers. The job is really a job. There's my fingers crossed. Um, and, uh, yeah. So thank you all. And I will be back in touch soon. I'm not going to sing because my roommate's asleep. Okay. Um, maybe next time. Okay. Bye.